Hey, I'm going to be uh, making um, an array of LEDs out of, uh, out of these tapes. Now these are WS2812B uh, LED tapes. You can tell that they're the, uh, the WS2812B because the, the LEDs have only got four connections on. Uh, the WS2812s had six connections. I quite like these. Apparently they're a little bit brighter. There are some improvements. Um, so I like to I like to use these. Uh, generally you can buy these in sort of one metre or a couple of metres uh, with a connector on the end. Uh, it's a sort of standard-ish kind of connector. It's a JST connector. Um, or you can buy them on reels. I bought a, a reel of... Uh, five meters, which is 60 LEDs per meter, um, and this comes with a connector on each end. Uh, very easy to cut, just cut them with a pair of scissors. Uh, there is a connection there, you just so you can separate them. So what I did, I, I cut them into um, into strips of 13, because what I'm trying to do is make a uh, a complete universe of LEDs in a square matrix. So what I did, I got a bit of board, which this one was uh, about 215 millimeters square, and I cut 13 strips off my five meter reel, 13 strips of 13 LEDs, which makes 169 LEDs. Uh, so three pixels per LED, uh, that makes 507. DMX channels. I've actually wired these so that the, uh, the the data will come in this end and the flow would be going round and snaking all the way down down all the way down to the bottom down to I think it probably comes out this end actually no it comes out this end um, so this end would then be connected to the power so I've got a power supply which is uh, capable of delivering uh, 50 watts 50 watts at 5 volts, so that's 10 amps, uh, which is just what I need for the maximum uh, current that these are, uh, the maximum current that these are, are going to take if all the whites are on at the same time. So it's very simple mathematics. Uh, they take, if you want to do it really approximately, they take about 50 milliamps per LED. So uh, you, you can work that out. It's, it's probably a little bit more than that, but just a general rule of thumb. 50 milliamps and then multiply it times the amount of LEDs that you got. Uh, you never really put them all on at white at the same time unless you're going to be doing some blinder. Okay, so that's that's it for part one. Um, I'll do some wiring. Uh, the wiring that I'm going to do is by linking these across to here and I'll see you in part two.